Today on Eat Live Love San Fernando Valley, we have a special treat. I'm taking you to my favorite Argentinian restaurant in LA. We're at Bodega Malbec in Toluca Lake. Let's go check them out. The San Fernando Valley has a lot to offer. Amazing food, rich history, tons of community events, and amazing people and organizations. I'm Scott Himmelstein with the Scott Himmelstein Group, and this is Eat Live Love San Fernando Valley. Javier, it's awesome to be here, man. It's good to have you here. All right, tell me a little bit about Bodega Malbec. This is one of my favorite Argentinian restaurants in LA. Thank you so much. Um, so the concept that we're trying to project to the public here, it's, a, it's an old bodega style, which is a place where people and families eat. Um, so we have a wood fire grill. We cook um, lots of beef there, uh, some fish. We also do pastas and, and some tapas to pay homage to our Italian and Spanish uh, heritage. Uh, but we strictly, we strictly like to, to focus on everything that goes around, like the quincho. Like, you know, you come to my house and I'll give you what we got to eat tonight. And we serve it on the table in boot planks and rustic by modern. So, uh, and also serve with uh, really good wines. So yeah, everybody's welcome to come in and try it. It's so a family style, uh, and then we also do private events, so welcome here whenever you like. I'm super excited to see how you guys make everything, so let's go back in the kitchen and check it all out. Let's go. I'm with eating here now with owner Javier and manager Rodrigo. All right, guys, so what are we gonna start with and tell me what we have here. Okay, so we've got uh, the empanadas. We have one beef and one spinach empanada. Then uh, we cook some salmon over the grill uh, with rice and Brussels sprouts. And then on the front over there, we have a pasta bolognese. So it's a, it's a linguine pasta with um, ground beef. The ground beef we use are pretty much all the the cuttings of New York, skirt steak, ribeye, everything that does not belong on the plate, on the actual plate, so we make it top quality beef. And then we have bife de chorizo, it's New York steak, cooked over wood fire, uh, papas fritas provenzal, these are the, uh, the fries with the garlic and the, and the parsley and a little bit of butter. We have a uh, coarse sea salt, chimichurri, and salsa criosa, this is a bell pepper sauce with just a bit of garlic, and uh, that's it. We have some wines that are coming up. So we can eat. Let's dive in. Good. Salud. Salud. Mm. Mm. And what I like about your empanadas, and so many times you, you find empanadas and they're always soggy in the in the middle. And just the texture yeah. of these empanadas. Um, it, it doesn't just it fall apart. So you got the soft, you know, obviously like you know, like all empanadas yeah. do in the middle, yeah. but then you got the crunchiness on the outside. The discs of empanada, the dough, they're homemade. The vegetable oil that we use is has to be at a really a perfect temperature I would say, but it has to be high. So it come crispy and they don't soak they don't soak up all the, the oil. Alright, so what's next? Next this is the uh, pasta. Sorry. So it's homemade linguine pasta with uh, the bolognese style the ground beef that we make here homemade as well. There you go. I like how the, all the juices meld together from the high quality meat and you can just taste how homemade the pasta truly is. So the salmon. Okay, this is um, Canadian salmon. Um, we cook it over a wood fire grill also. Crunchy on the outside, uh, soft and juicy on the inside. Served with Brussels sprouts and rice. It's a saffron rice with uh, peppers, bell peppers, onions, and uh, peas. Uh, let's try this out. It's one of those things that's very unexpected because a lot of people may not be used to it. It's like you say, like you got a little bit of the crunchiness outside yeah. of the salmon, yeah. but inside it's so soft. Yeah. And uh, it's just the perfect, the perfect combination. Last, but not finally. Bife chorizo, New York steak with French fries Provencal. And then how do you cook the steak? Good, the steak is cooked uh, over a wood fire grill. Uh, 
put it olive oil, salt, pepper, put it on the, um, on the hot side of the, the coals of the wood fire, and then we bring it down to the cooler side on the front. Basically, you're searing it, and that gives it texture and flavor, and then medium rare. And that's it. Wait, so let's cut it up. See? There you go, center cut. And I'll be honest, this is probably the best meat that we will be trying on this show so far. So I'm really excited to be able to try this meat. All right. Mm. A single vineyard your mother. The meat is so juicy. So juicy and really tender. Everything here at Bodega Malbec is amazing. Guys, if you're looking for a fun place to maybe on a date night, just to go out and celebrate a special occasion, or just some of the best Argentinian food in Los Angeles, then make sure you come down to Bodega Malbec in Toluca Lake. If you like this episode, make sure you like, comment, and share so we can support these guys and have as many people learn more about them. And again, we look forward to seeing you next time on Eat, Live, Love, San Fernando Valley.